Amy Bainbridge's investigation into exploitative sales practices by Telstra to people on welfare prompted industry-wide changes and resulted in Telstra offering to buy back debt from thousands of vulnerable Australians. Her reporting gave voice to people affected by the Telco's actions. I had no idea that this problem was bigger than Broome. And then I just bumped into someone from Alice Springs, another financial counsellor, and we started a little network and before long we discovered that this exactly the same practices were happening in Broome, in Alice Springs, in the APY lands, in Darwin, in Cairns. It's happening all over the outback.